Y'all, oh my God. The second that I heard that E.T. was in trouble, I said, oh my God. Oh my God. Like, no. Like, we can't just sit back and, like, let this happen. Like, no. Like, we got to do something. So, of course, y'all. Let's talk about it. I know y'all want to get to the tea, and baby, we will. But for those of y'all that's been living under a rock, baby, my name is Scott Santana. I've only been on YouTube since I was 2016. Started off going viral, telling stories about my crazy life. A couple of years later, I started doing ratchet recipes, went viral on TikTok. Then I opened up a channel, a lot of souls, where I was, you know, using my spiritual and psychic gifts to help the girls and whip them back into alignment. In other words, baby, she's gifted. And see, now I'm here to share all of those gifts on one channel. Beside me, whether it's a deep dive, a commentary video, cooking, music, Reading harvest toast. Baby, if I want to upload a video of me picking my nose and breathing for 60 minutes, I'm a it. My house, my rules. I mean, I just ask that y'all follow me over on Twitter so I can stop talking to myself. And before you go and try to seek help and seek therapy, baby, seek me. Go to my website and book yourself a personal reading if you need one. Now, feel free to sound off in the comments, but be respectful and act like you got that act right. Now, this channel is for critical thinkers. We may not always agree. You may not always even like me. But one thing's for sure, your life will be changed after experiencing me. So subscribe. Now, enough of me rambling, child. I think we made it past the part that was needed to get this video monetized, child. Now, you do be going. Let's get into it. I want people to have fun. Let's kick back. Let's get into a little tea. Let's not get too crazy, but let's enjoy the sip. But let's get to the chi chi, the kiki, the. The internet bull. Oh, oh, <laughs> jump scare, jump scare. Oh, my bad, y'all. What's going on, y'all? It's Scotty and Santa, aka Ch 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 Ch, and we are back for another <sighs> Baddies East update. Oh my God, y'all, y'all, y'all. Now, let me get this out the way, because I know it's always going to be a dumb mm, in the back that want to sit and, and, and make it a little too, too, too personal and want to start projecting and acting like this situation is about them. Now, obviously, we are not in the business of wishing death on anybody. That's not what we do. That's not what we will ever, ever do. OK, I want to make that extremely clear. But however, there is a thing called karma. <laughs> and I don't know A lot of y'all seem to think that you are in control of karma And when karma strikes and how it strikes And baby, you can't tell the universe what to do So is this situation karma? I don't know Is this situation, you know, a way of life balancing itself out? You know, what you put in is what you get out You know, whatever you do Whatever action is a reaction. I mean, literally, that's the definition of karma. That's exactly how karma works. So who knows? I just know that certain situations and certain moments happened. And then now we have this moment here that's happening. And of course, y'all already know we're going to do a deep dive and get into her. But before we do that, go like this video. <laughs> Okay, child, let's go ahead and get into her. Um, before we do that, <laughs> let me fix my banner real quick because it's looking a little struggly. Hold on. Bear with me for a sec. Okay, it's looking a little struggly. Okay. We just said to fix that real quick. Okay. But child, let's go ahead and get into the tea. 
So, like I said earlier, I was minding my business. Y'all know I've been filming, doing all of these, you know, recording all of these astrology tarot videos that y'all need to go watch. Y'all need to go watch, okay? I uploaded six videos today. And baby, when I tell you that I started that shit at 12 o'clock and I did not finish until like 7, listen, whew, energy takes a lot out of you. It takes a whole hell of a lot out of you. And so, like I said, I did a whole bunch of... um a whole bunch of tarot videos. Um, you know, I started off doing Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, Leo, and Virgo. And then hopefully tomorrow I'll get to the other six. But in the meantime, definitely check out the Zodiac sign if it applies. And also check out this collective video that I did. Okay. Because there, there is some major shit going down and this is going to affect everybody globally, like everyone, every human being. Okay. So just go check that out the here and see what's up. Okay. Now let's go ahead and get into this. I don't, necessarily feel comfortable calling it tea, given the, you know, the severity of the situation, but child, I don't really know what's going on. I just know I saw the Bad Girls Club tea page posted. So child, in terms of this video, it's tea. Okay. So the Bad Girls Club tea posted, let's pray it gets better for ET. I don't know if y'all remember, but she had just gotten a BBL lipo surgery right before filming the Baddies East reunion. Okay. So actually, before we do all of that, let's get into that and then we can come back to this. Okay. So do y'all remember this? Let me turn that off. But this is when E.T. had took her ass down there to goals. Okay, I guess she tapped in with Roly and said, you know what? They doing two for ones. Bitch, let me go get my body done. And mind you, this wig that she wearing on her head is one of Natalie's old wigs. But we, we not even going to get into that, child. How, how you go get surgery to get a new body, but you wearing somebody's old wig as a new wig for you is beyond me. Okay? But listen, E.T. was real proud and bold. She said that... Nobody was going to stop her from getting her surgery and that the BBL was not going to stop her from swinging, right? So just keep that in mind as y'all listening to this video. Now I'm swinging. Now I don't care if I just had a BBL. If somebody run up on me right now, I'm swinging. And I, I'm expecting to be shit up. Like this? Like this. Like be that. shit up. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So I be shit up with one leg. Mm -hmm. When I broke my leg, I fought on the auditions. So I don't care. Mm -hmm. I don't care if I just Let's had to be Somebody run up on me right now. I'm swinging. And I, I'm expecting to be shit up. Like this? Like this. <laughs> be shit up. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I be shit up with one leg. Mm -hmm. When I broke my leg, I fought on the auditions. So I don't care. Mm -hmm. I don't care if mm -hmm. I just had to be If somebody run up on me okay. right now, I'm swinging. Just one now, more time for the people in the back. Because you, you know it's always one person. It's always one person. Just like I got people in the in the Roly video that I just did. It's people in the back. That's like, oh no, Sky, you hating her body look at girl, fuck all of that. We don't like them. Why I keep trying to take up for these motherfuckers that we don't like? I don't care if she came out looking as skinny as Mariah Mariah Carey. I don't give a fuck. We don't like these hoes. We're gonna say the opposite of what it is, and we're gonna say what it is, but we're not gonna say what it is if if that's what they want us to say. No, because we don't like these hoes. Okay, got me over here getting tongue tied when we need to be tying they fucking tongues in a tie. Like this? Like this. Why be shit that? up. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I be shit up with one leg. When I broke my leg, I fought on the auditions. Okay. Okay. So she was talking all of that shit, laying down at that. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Go to this? LA with Dr. Solomon and our baddie ET. Here we Go ahead, doctor. First of all, I don't know why she keeps throwing up that W. Because all she do was take L's. Please stop throwing up that W. Like, at this point, girl, it's bad luck. It's bad luck. Every time you throw it up, I swear to God, somebody punch you in your face. I swear to God, you get beat up. I swear to God, you take another L in life. Okay? I swear to God that life comes and beats you up. I swear to God that you lose another 10 fans. I swear to God that you get uglier, that your face get more swollen. Like, girl, stop throwing up that damn W. Please. Maybe she manifesting. Maybe that's what it is. Okay, girl, turn that W around to an M. That's what you need to do. Okay, fuck throwing up a W because you're not taking no wins. No, turn it around to an M so that the universe can see that you're trying to manifest. Do it like that. Goals LA with Dr. Solomon and our baddie E.T. Mm -mm. Here we go. Go ahead, doctor. Dr. Okay. Solomon might be from Ethereum. <laughs> no, well, E.T. works for me. Just don't phone home the numbers. Okay. So ET is going to be getting uh, a 360 flex scope, and we're working on uh, a double BBL for her. 
she and I already chatted about the things that we can do. She's really quite, quite good for all of this stuff. Uh, you wouldn't know that she's had two babies. Don't do that. That's Mariah's move. You put them out yourself, right? Yeah. Yeah. Her tummy looks great. She's got good muscles, and she's got a little bit of loose skin, but no extra skin. So this is all mm. just in fact. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Was that I a dick at Roly? Was that a dick at Roly? Wait. Her, and you push them out yourself, right? Yeah. Yeah. Her tummy looks great. She's got good muscles. And she's got a little bit of loose skin, but no extra skin. So, <laughs> what the hell was this doctor when Roly got her shit done? Because she got a lot of extra skin. Where was he when Roly was getting her shit done? Now, how y'all go to the same same um, same place with different doctor? Please make that make sense. I mean, I know it makes sense, but y'all understand what the fuck I'm saying. Y'all know what I'm saying. She only went to goals because of Roly. Okay, it was her goal to be like Roly, to go to goals, to have a golden body. So this is all just in fact. Yeah. Um, she and I have been debating on how much fat is there. So we can, take, we can take bets, but um, it's enough. Okay, so what I'm going to do is mark you. So I put all these orientation marks in, which help me uh, work when you're laying down. Ooh, I'm Girl, you should be. No, these are orientated. It should be. That was the universe tapping on your shoulder. That was the universe. I'm sorry, but in this case, tapping on your non existent food, but I guess because she doesn't have no extra skin. Okay, so we can't fast shame her. Okay. But that was the universe tapping on you. It's tapping on you to let you know, like, girl, girl, you sure you want to do this? You sure this shall go? Here it goes. You sure? Okay, because the way that Roly had a goal and went to goals to get her goal fulfilled and came out looking like a golden delicious apple, we could really talk about it. We could really talk about it. Yeah, these are orientation marks. Okay. This just helps me because when you lay down all this shit. Mm. Where was he when Roly was getting her shit done? Why she ain't asked for him? Okay, so this was E.T. showing off her new body. Still throwing up them W's. I will say her hair looks phenomenal. Her hair looks phenomenal. Phenomenal. Okay. Maybe she had a little bit extra in her budget. So maybe she ain't paid 28K like Roly did. Maybe Roly had to pay extra because she got extra skin. Okay. So maybe that's why Roly had to pay 28,000. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe ET only paid like 28, $28, 2800. Okay. So she had extra money in her budget to go and get a wig because this, this looks phenomenal. Not only is it sitting right, it's slate right, lace wear, baby, the custom color is everything. So this is the best she ever looked, honestly. 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 I don't know why she didn't just wear this hair to the reunion. Let's not act like she don't reuse hair. Do we need to go back to the wig that she got from Natalie and refurbished? So let's not act like, let's not act like, I don't know why she don't walk around looking just like this every day. This is the look. Right here. She looks good right here. Oh. That booty look a little hard, but she looks good. She looks she looks really good there. I'm not even gonna hold you. So let's keep going. Let's keep going now. Is there anything else we can find on her? Yeah, at Gold's Plastic Surgery, and it's time to get this body right. Y'all see, I got a little, mm, 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 mm. but we gonna get that, mm. <laughs> watch, just watch. It's your girl Scarface in the bed. Honestly, all she needed to do was go on Amazon and get a BBL shapewear. That's all she really needed to do. She didn't really need to, <sighs> like I can, like I'm not one of them people that's like, oh, why are you going to get a BBL? Just go to the gym. Well, she, I wish y'all would shut the fuck up because you can't get a BBL body from the gym. It's just not possible. And you could get a hard ass. Mm -hmm. You can get a hard ass from the gym, like, you know, working on your glutes and all of that shit. But like, that's not going to give you legs and hips and body, body, body. OK, and that's what these girls be wanting. They be wanting the body. They don't want just a fat ass. They want the body. They want the body. So I can understand why people get BBLs. But her, she didn't need to get a BBL. She didn't. All she needed to do was go get some damn shapewear. Who the hell is managing these girls? Because like somebody else said, she should have went and got her teeth done first. It's the priorities for me. 
it's the priorities for me. What you gonna be doing? Coming into the room ass backwards? Like you coming into the room ass first? Like what was your teeth is the first thing that people see, baby. The fuck? Anything else? Is there anything else? Uh-uh, turn that off. Turn that off. <laughs> not E.T. but her body done. That is not E.T. That is not <laughs> That's not E.T. Why is niggas playing? Why is niggas playing on my top? Okay, anything else? Anything else? Okay. Um, Let me type in Scarface. Because I... Damn, do people really not like her? Oh, wait. She's talking about getting new teeth. Wait, she looks pretty. No, but... Mm. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. I mean, I just like when girls have, like, the blowout look to me. I'm not a fan of hairstyles. I'm a fan of, like, natural everyday hair. Like, y'all know I'm a 90s baby. Hence my 90s music. Speaking of, child, did y'all go and stream my new song yet? Y'all bitches better add it to the playlist, ho. Whatever you want, babe. I like when girls had a blowout look. So if she was taking a braids off just to have that blowout look, that 90s, 80s look, oh my God, she would look so cute here. She really would. Oh my God, she really would. Like right here in this picture, she looks great. I can just imagine if that braid was like out and this was like a blowout 80s, 90s look. She need to let me style her. And I'm not even a stylist, but Chad, that's how all y'all need to be. Okay, y'all stay paying hundreds of dollars to go and get this prom hair. What like what what be with y'all with these prom hairstyles, these wedding hairstyles? Like, girl, absolutely the fuck not. I like the blowout look. Okay. I'm getting permanent veneers. Like most people get the tap on behind. I'm not getting that. Kiss Got a bag and fix my feet. Hope you hold no, it ain't cheap. Uh, Period. Yes, especially the permanent one. I'm the hottest. Uh-uh. Uh, no. Turn that off. Turn that off. Oh, so she did fix her teeth. When the hell did she do that? So that must have just happened like last week. And why he look young as hell like he could be her brother? Why they still small? Why she still got dinosaur teeth? What the hell did she do? Where are these hoes going to like get these surgeries done? Because how you come out with the teeth that look well, I guess because Roly went and got a body that looked the same. So it like y'all bitches are paying just to do what? Do what? Like I feel like y'all are literally just paying to go get their autograph. Y'all are paying to go get a selfie with a doctor. Like, like what what exactly are they doing? Y'all paying them to promote them on y'all social media. That's what it's giving. I'm using cold. I don't know why. Oh, all this fucking ink. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. Makeup. Okay, so this was right after the reunion. EZ does face check, and after the baddies, East reunion and says she's fine. When to lose, I got jumped, whatever you want to call it. I look fine, and I am fine. This happened first round with Trasiki, and I ran three rounds with Maleski. See, this is why she got beat up seven different times, except for the time of Sapphire. She kind of ate that, okay? But the rest of them times, they ripped my lashes. I believe that this was makeup. I definitely believe that that was makeup. Um, okay, so I mean, listen, at this point, we already know what it is. So let's go ahead and get into the tweets. So this is the tweets. So update. Scarface is allegedly going MIA due to health concerns following her BBL from hell that states her organs are having issues in exclusive group chat. Not exclusive group chat. I'm sorry, you guys. I have a health problem. 
which is why I need to focus on me. Keep me in your prayers. Somebody said, E.T., is your stomach hurting? Somebody else said, she said, it's her organs. Somebody else said, delete. <sighs> These are clearly children. But, okay, I mean, all she said was she got a health problem. I mean, it could be a lot going on. It could be a lot going on. Like, the girl could be blind. She could be, like, I don't know, deaf in one ear. She could be, like, I don't know, losing, like, a toenail. She could be losing like an artery or some shit. Like, I don't know. Like, she said a health problem. So it could really be anything. How are we and who are we to assume that this automatically has to deal with her BBL? But because we don't like her, we just going to assume that. Like everybody else doing. So let's keep going. Let's go to the comments. Praying that she's okay. But no shade. You went to goals. Everybody knows they got deaths under their belt. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Because everybody knows that they got deaths under their belt. And y'all still went there because it was free. See, so maybe that's why Roly didn't do the second BBL on live. Because the first one was free, but the second one, they said you got to pay. Or maybe she paid 28000 on top of it being free. I don't know, chap. I don't know. What I do know is that they at least cut off some money for promotion. Because I know Alonzo Arnold went and got the same BBL done by them doctors at Goals. That's what everybody keep going as though they're not killing motherfuckers. But okay. And then y'all want us to get online and feel sorry. Why am I feel sorry if you know the fucking death rate and you didn't do your due diligence, didn't do your due research, and was just like, to hell with my body. Okay, so when your body start hurting like hell, when 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 it started burning like hell, then don't come to me for my sympathy, bitch. Because you knew what the fuck you was doing before you did it. Period. Okay? Period. And then same time, too. So I hate, you know what, man? Let me just rant for a little second just to make this video even longer. Stop getting on these goddamn baddies videos trying to project and give sympathy to these hoes that's literally on a show that's about fighting at any moment these hoes can die you can literally hit somebody the wrong way and snap their damn neck or somebody can die from a motherfucking concussion please stop acting like we watching real housewives of atlanta or something a little bit more wholesome like on a hallmark or the e-channel these bitches are getting paid thousands upon thousands of dollars. These bitches are getting paid your salary, your yearly salary to get up here and act the motherfucking fool and fight. So if we want to get online and kiki and joke about they fucking ass shots busting or they lips being busted or a motherfucking being fat like a can of fucking busted biscuits, that's what the hell we going to do, ho. That's what the hell we going to do. Miss me with all of this. Oh, stop trying to fat shame. Oh, they do look like oh, they, fuck all of that, girl. Fuck all of that, because we can talk about you, too. What's up? These girls get paid to get on TV and act like motherfucking monkeys, okay? So don't get mad when we start treating them like the monkeys that they are and start <laughs> rambling the motherfucking cage, out. The fuck? Want to get on TV and act like a damn baboon and to get mad when we call you an ass? Stop acting like one. Okay, you wouldn't get donkey the day if he wasn't acting like a damn donkey. <sighs> baby girl should have gotten that BBL after the reunion. Who would have get surgery days before you have to go on a reunion and know you had phase to run? You know she had no real friends on her corner. Let's talk about it. She probably did, but fame is a hell of a drug. <laughs> and plus, y'all, y'all, the way that y'all hoes be so dumb over dick. Talking about something. Oh, I got this body for me. I got this body for me. No, you didn't, bitch. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. Because you, you don't even know how to feel good about yourself until a nigga start looking at you. So please cut that shit out. Cut that shit out in 2024. The way that motherfuckers is raised from young, okay, to, to go to work and, and niggas is raised to get the bacon and bring it home so the bitches could cook it. Like, please cut it out. The way that makeup is marketed towards y'all, the way that the whole Disney princess fairy tale dream is marketed to y'all as little girls, please cut it the fuck out. Miss me with all of that. I got the BBL for me so I can feel good about my body. No, bitch, you got the BBL so that a nigga can look at you, be like, ooh, that fat ass, and you could think you, that you about to win that nigga that you always wanted, and then they get you, and then they treat you like every other motherfucking porn star, and then they go leave your ass for a white girl. That's why you got it. But y'all not ready for that conversation. I pray someone stop getting all these unnecessary surgeries and realize they don't have to go under the belt, under the knife to get results. Shut the fuck up, nigga. Some people do. Speaking of Roly, she do. Roly is next. I pray she be okay and hit. Wait, hold on. Let's click on that because Roly might have health complications. Talking about some, I'm healthy. I'm healthy. I'm healthy. Girl, you don't look like it. You do not look like it. 
I don't like Roly either, but we can't wish bad on people. Is it wishing bad or is it normalizing reality? Hmm. Hmm. Nobody's wishing bad. Don't nobody want nobody to die. But at the same time, again, when you go out there and purposely go to doctors that are killing motherfuckers for the same procedures you went and got, why am I sitting here feeling sorry for you? Especially when you've already proven that you are a trash human being on this trash ass show. Again, like I keep saying, y'all gonna get the fuck out of my comment. And it's not everybody, but that's why I just be rolling my eyes when people be trying to take up for these bitches. Again, we are not watching Sister Sister. This is not no wholesome show. This is a show where they get paid literally your yearly salary to fuck each other up. The goal of this show is to see who can fight. And then y'all want to sit and bring morals into this goddamn shit. Morals and codes of ethics. All of that shit went out the fucking window as soon as they signed up for this shit. Exactly like I said, Nene Leaks being on Zeus, that's a bad look for her. Because who's going to want to touch Nene after working with a company like this? Oh. But anyways, you know. Let's keep going. E.T. needs to be on Now That's TV. That's exactly where she needs to be. I do hope she gets better, but that's what happens when you ain't go to a proper surgeon. Let's talk about it. And if a couple of people, like a couple more people need to die before motherfuckers get it, then oh well. Oh well. That seems to be a common theme. And I'm going to hold my tongue with that because if I really say what I want to say, oh, <laughs> that, probably, that should have probably get me canceled. Y'all will probably unsubscribe with some of the shit I really want to say. But it, se it seems to be that it's not until the worst and the most inevitable shit happens. That's when people want to wake up and be like, oh, oh. No, oh, maybe that's just the thing as a human, because even with a toddler, it's like a toddler could keep putting their hand above a stove, but it's not till they, they little ass get burnt that they learn, okay, maybe I shouldn't do that. But again, like I said, that's a conversation for a different motherfucking day, because I could go on a whole rant and tangent right now, but if you don't realize by 2024, baby, by the end of this year, you will. You will. <sighs> Tzatziki, be her ass that bad. Ooh. She probably did, and then it probably complicated the surgery even bad. Nigga, she got jumped to forget, wait, for the whole damn cast. Well, E.T. should have kept her damn mouth closed. I mean, I could go right back to the TikTok where she was sitting there popping shit from her stomach. How you popping shit from being on the couch on your stomach? Trying to be all cute and creative. Now look what happened. Now look what happened. Complications. And we supposed to feel sorry? Sorry? Girl, bye. I don't care how much I don't like somebody, they health. It's one thing I won't play about or make jokes about. I, ha, ha, ha. We could take this show on the road, baby. We could do a whole comedy tour. Who gives a fuck? Who gives a fuck? Who gives a fuck? Now, again, why are we trying to bring sensitivity and all of that? And so I don't care. I don't care. You're proving yourself to be a trash human being. You've already proven yourself to be a trash human being. It was all fun and shits and giggles when you're sitting there talking about beating innocent bitches that ain't do shit to you. Talking about beating they ass and beating they head. And why is that okay? Because, again, they could easily get a fucking concussion from you beating they head in for no fucking reason. But it's not okay for us to sit and talk about this. Girl, fuck all of that. Equal opportunist offenders over here. Fuck all of that. She did not need a BBL. She didn't have that much fat in the first place. A BBL will not turn you cute magically. It's not going to. And it literally is the most dangerous type of plastic surgery. It is. And these girls keep taking it as jokes. So what are we supposed to do? Y'all mad at us laughing when these girls are taking these surgeries as a joke. Was DC Young Fly's baby mother not just killed a couple of months ago in May? Yet we still out here like, again, I don't judge. I don't judge. Wait till I get mine. Okay? So I don't judge. But at the same time, like, come on now. It's 2024. Why we still got to repeat? Do your research. Go to the right people. Da, 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 da. No, y'all ran to the damn doctor that was the cheapest or the one that was willing to do your surgery for a few Instagram followers. Oh, you you with Zeus? Oh, oh. I know that's going to bring more attention over here. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'll do your surgery. Girl... If you die, that's when you, ha, 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 because you thought your life was a joke. You you treated your life as a joke, okay? And now the devil got the last laugh, because that's probably going to end up as in hell for the sins that you done committed on this goddamn earth. Like, please, get the fuck out of here, because I could really go off and go in. 
Well, whose fault is that? Baby, maybe should have set the reunion out or waited like her bestie, Roly Poly. Let's talk about it. And actually, let's talk about it. Because not no waited like bestie, Roly Poly. I mean, yeah, she waited for the second surgery, but let's not forget how she got the first surgery, then immediately went on the fucking show. And then, mind you, the show was only filmed in three weeks, so the whole entire time she was walking around with the BBL pillow and still sitting there trying to beat bitches' ass. So again, she's another dumbass. She's another one. They may have come into this world together, but child, I mean, come into this world alone, but they both going to hell together. <sighs> wow, I wouldn't even have went on a reunion for that screen time. It's not worth my health. Some money ain't good money. Y'all would have had to have me on Zoom and I would have had verbal fights until I was held. Right, right. Nobody's saying don't go on a fighting show and don't fight. I mean, well, yes, we are. If your name is Sky. Okay, yes, we are. And not Sky Santana. Because I stand on business, how so we talking about fly tatty sky, okay? So, unless you fly tatty sky, maybe go on that show and you don't need to physically fight, you can verbally fight. Like, you could have you could have made adjustments, but you got the BBL done, and then after the BBL, you said you talked all that shit, and then got Molly bought by seven bitches. So, now we're supposed to feel bad? No, mm -mm. where's the popcorn? Can Sunday hurry up and get here so we can watch? Oh, I did Because <laughs> not only were you dumb by going to goals in the first place, not only were you dumb by getting a BBL before the reunion, not only were you done by sitting down, getting the BBL anyways, and then before the reunion, talking all of this shit, saying, I'm going to still fight you even though I'm still healing. But now, again, we're supposed to feel sorry? I'm sorry. That, that's the most sorry I can feel. It's saying I'm sorry. Who the hell is this? Move. No free promo. <sighs> Let's go to the Bad Girls Club C page and see if there was anything else that came up. Wait, let me show you a clip of Natalie. Because <laughs> I keep telling y'all, I keep trying to convince y'all, Natalie is unproblematic. She's just unserious. And once you realize that, you will love her. Hey, hey, you can record me all day. One thing about Natalie Knight, she's gonna be the same bitch. Slap that hoe. <laughs> Mind you, Natalie's talking to nobody. She's just literally randomly pointing and talking to thin air. Hey, hey, you can record me all day. One thing about Natalie Knight, she's gonna be the same bitch. Slap that hoe. <laughs> I wonder what the hell they was filming because y'all see my baby punch in the back. I see punch. Say hey, hey punch. Hey punch. I, look, who this right here? This one right here behind Natalie. I don't know why he's trying to be on a roster. I don't know why he's trying to be on a roster. That beard not full enough to be on a roster, sir. The beard is not full enough to be on a roster, sir. Is that DJ why Scott behind? <laughs> so, well, let's go to ET's. Uh, what you gonna call it? Let's go to ET's. What you gonna call it? And see if she maybe posted anything in regards to her health. Hopefully, she's feeling better. Oh, okay. February 11th. So she's promoting a reunion again. So I don't feel bad. Then I don't feel bad. I, I motherfucking don't feel bad. Not you up here promoting a goddamn reunion. But yet you have a health problems. So, okay. I don't feel bad though. Oh, she's promoting it because now she's taking bookends. Oh, this is from six weeks ago. Okay. Well. That's the end of the video. <laughs> Let me know what y'all thought about all of that down in the comment box below. <sighs> As if I can fuck. Anyway, one more thing before I let y'all hoes go. One more motherfucking thing. How? Yes, I am the leader of the new school. Bringing cotton and a whole lot of new clothes. Giving the guys of the shit to the people. And this body, this song gets three through out. Now I don't want to kiki ho. This shit right here on repeat, yo. Not here. What are y'all gonna see me though? In charge of the girl that's chi chi ho. I'm the motherfucking queen of the shit. Who you know? Running up the green till it slid. Throwing ass in the digit turn on my head. Took a bitch talk shit. Then it shout to the lips, bitch. All my bitches say ignorant. All my bitches say hella bit. All my bitches say in the club. Unless you can't handle it. All my bitches say all my bitches say hella bit. All my bitches say in the club. 
I just <laughs> jump scare. Before I end this video, I just want to send the. I can't even sound convincing. I want to send the most heart warming. And when I say warm, I mean like hot, like hell. I'm going to send the most heated, heart warming feelings and wishes to E.T. And I hope and pray that she. I'm not allowed to pray for demons. Never mind, y'all. Let me know what y'all think about this down in the comment box below. As if I give a fuck. And um, go stream my music. As if you give a fuck. I love each and every one of y'all hosts. Allegedly in HD audio. And bitch, like I motherfucking said, I uploaded collective videos. Okay? I uploaded a collective video as well as Zodiac signs. Y'all hoes ain't got Zodiac signs. Y'all hoes don't know when the fuck y'all was born. Okay? I be uploading 12 Zodiac sign videos. There's six already uploaded. So, child, if it apply, go watch it and let it fly. Okay? And book a damn reading while they 50% off. I love each and every one of y'all, allegedly, and each one of y'all. And I'll see you hoes in the next one. Bye. Oh, and somebody said that this outro should be like an intro for uh, BGC and baddies. I kind of agree. <laughs> Universal bad bitch, everybody language. Everybody knows she the mud, mud, bad, bad. Universal bad bitch, everybody language. Everybody knows she the mud, mud, bad, bad. Universal bad bitch, everybody language. Everybody knows she the mud, mud, bad, bad. Swimming up, but wasn't when I'm coming up. Fuck it up, nothing how they cutting up. Now these niggas swimming up, but wasn't.